Honestly, uh, Reborn Flames, uh, that's not the problem. Kathleen's actually going to be joining us on Wednesday, Night Watch. The problem is that uh, Beach's sleep schedule is real messed up. Real messed up. Yeah. He is not even presently awake, potentially. We, we, we are lucky to have him with us. <laughs> yeah. yeah. This week, not, I mean, at all. Well, uh, you know, broadly. I mean, we are also well, lucky to have him with us. His home planet could call him home at any, any moment. <laughs> yeah. I mean, the real talk is that Zeta is a challenging shift in terms yeah. of trying to keep hours to it. It and sucks. No, Beach like, isn't sick. It's just, it's just the Zeta life. Like, trying to shift your schedule even a little bit to either show, to like, to show up earlier is, our, is a huge challenge. And if you're... That only works if you're, like, perfect at getting your sleep schedule flipped. If you're having any issues with that, it's so hard. I see my lady friend... Uh, two hours before I go to bed when she comes here to come for her shift. And that's it, because she comes home when I am dead asleep. Yep. Mm -hmm. I, as I flash back to my driver shift many years ago where I had to flip my schedule to do it, and then I missed my next two normal shifts because I was in a weird ethereal sleep deprivation, deprivation haze. Yep. It's challenging. It's work. Yep. Yeah, the worst thing... Have you seen that bus stop, Ian? It's coming. Right. The worst thing is not make, changing you. your sleep schedule, it's not changing it consistently. Like, yeah. if, yeah. If, if you change it to be Zeta and then you're like, oh, but this one day I'm going to come in earlier, that's going to mess you right yeah. up. Oh, yeah, driver shifts. Yeah, see, it was fine in the first year uh, when, like, three of us lived in that building. Just go to sleep. When it was in our living room. <laughs> yeah. Oh, do we have the bus stop coming up? Uh, soon. Point two. You, you assumed the, you assumed yeah. the position. Yeah, <laughs> point two of a mile. I, I didn't want to interrupt this good story, though. No, no, that was it. It was just that oh. we, we lived, it was in, in a oh, There it is. So I just go to, just walk down the hall and go yeah. to bed. Oh, you can well, see it. We're doing it. And you can see it even further away. It's it, it's a pinpoint, but yeah, no problems here. Whoop. Night bus stop. Open. Close. Let them get on. Yeah. Yeah. Let them get off. Driver's taking a coffee break. <laughs> <laughs> and go. Stressing me <laughs> out yeah. so much as I watched the I was watching the temperature gauge rise yeah. and I was terrified. All right, that's night buses oh on uh, the menu. Woo! Stressing chat out. <sighs> We need some excitement, you know? It's, it's late night, we need to get that adrenaline back up. Before we go directly to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I wonder about that, how everyone else does this. Like, the thing that surprised me about Beach's schedule is I assumed that he would be up late in the afternoon and then come in here and then go to bed as soon as Zeta was over, but it, mm. it appears that he is getting up right before Zeta doing Zeta and then being up for a while. That's how does, you need to, how does everyone do night watch? Do you have to wind down or do you stay I, up for I a while? I 100% have to wind down for like yeah. two or three hours. I'm usually yeah. up till 3 a.m. Yeah. yeah that's... I get back to my Airbnb. I watch some TikToks. I briefly check in on the YouTubes to see what upload we're at. Um, just for interest sakes. And then I just try to fall asleep. The flip side of that means that because I don't wind down, I'm here relatively early because I still, mm. and this is, hey Chad, if you're wondering why I seem to show up very early and yet still be here at midnight, when I get back, I just immediately go to bed. So I still get seven to eight hours of sleep, which puts me at, you know, 9 a.m. So yeah, I'm gonna come in and hang out with people. I am getting a full night's sleep. <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> yeah. The other bit. I also don't live here. I'm not like I can't just like stay at home and like vibe on my computer. That's not here. The other bit of it for me is I'm on new meds, which make me sleep a lot. Yep. So I've been sleeping 12 hours a day. My life is like an hour or two around Desert Bus and Desert Bus. My my shift here. <laughs> That's it. We try we, we we try to get as much as the appropriate amount of sleep as we can. But a lot of us also do a lot of stuff during the day to prepare for what comes up at night. I know I've been uh, jamming on getting this late night dub fight put together over the past few days and it's still coming along. Also, Rachel and I have magic to play. We have to get up. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh. yeah. I am got to wake up to lose to Jordan. 